Hello and welcome. Today's question is, say I had three clips in a row on the same channel. Would it be possible to delete the middle one without the third automatically moving to fill its space? In my videos I have parts where I am on camera and then just audio, but every time I deattach audio then remove video, the next clip takes its place. All right, let's recreate this project. I think I have a, an idea what this might look like. Okay, so here we go. We have three clips from free interviews. Allowing my company to do is test their systems. Okay, they one. showed us a lot of their tactics, how they do things. Two. We showing them ways that we were doing things. We have a and three. That's built up of everything from now, how do we remove a video of this clip without making this move to the left? So if we just delete this with the key X, it moves to the left. But what the goal is, is to preserve the audio from here. First up, let me bring up a visualization of the keyboard. I guess I'll put this over here. Yeah, it should be fine. So here you can track which key I press. For example, space, space. Here we go, space. Or A, or V. Okay, so first of all, we need, of course, to separate the audio. So let's just do that. Deattach audio. Let's see, we can multi-select clips now. So let's try to deattach. Mm, that doesn't work yet. Okay, so we have to do it separately. Okay, so now we have audio and video separately. We could mute the audio, for example. All right. Now we want to delete this. But if I press X, did you just see that? If I select the clip and press X, then it deletes the entire clip and Ripple deletes it, basically. Or if I right-click remove, it does the same. But if I right-click lift, then it doesn't move the rest. But even better, just hit the delete key. Let me show you that again. The delete key on the keyboard, DEL, or the backspace key. Again, backspace. By the way, what if you for some strange reason want this clip to move to the left when you delete this? Then just turn off ripple edits across all tracks. And if I X this now, then it moves to the left. Not what I want, probably not what was wanted here, just wanted to show you. So let's control Z out of this and turn ripple edit across all tracks back on. From a beginner's perspective, there are multiple ways to delete a clip. My favorite by far is to use the X key because it is very close to where my hand usually is positioned, which is near control Z most of the time or on the ASDF row. So just use a right click lift or select it and backspace or select it and delete key if you don't want stuff to move around. Hope this helps. If you want stuff to move around, click and X or right click and remove. And if you want stuff to only move on one track, disable ripple edits across all tracks and then select the clip and press X or right click and remove. All right, I hope this helps. Have fun editing in Shotcut. Until next time, ciao. They showed us a lot of their tactics, how they do things, and we were showing them ways that we were doing things. We have a diverse team that's built up of everything from critical care nursing staff to internal medicine doctors.